Do the Dallas Cowboys have the right personnel to run Mike McCarthy's West Coast offense? This, I, this is a great question because yeah. Bree, there are people that think McCarthy's doing this for McCarthy. <laughs> and there's, to some degree, you want to captain your own ship. Yep. And Bring in your own guys. Abs and you're, yep. we're seeing that all over the place. Right. And if the ship is going to go down, yeah. and most of them do in the NFL, not in the ocean, actually, <laughs> but in the NFL, most ships eventually go down. I, I want to be in charge of it. Yeah. I, I want to go down doing it my way. But he would not have installed this, and they're in the process of installing the West Coast offense. Mm -hmm. He wouldn't have done it if it was ill-fitting. There are coaches that have done that. Um, Bill Parcells will do that. He'll, he'll roll into town, yeah. and we're, we're playing my defense. I don't care what you guys are used yeah. to. If you remember when McCarthy first came here, he could have put in the West Coast offense then, yes. but didn't because he saw that Dak and Kellen and the language were working. Right. Now here we are three years later and he wants it to work better. So uh, I think it's an unselfish move in a way, the, the, the body of work yeah. with Mike McCarthy. It's unselfish what he's done to get him here, but you know, C.D. Lamb can excel mm -hmm. in a West Coast offense. Uh, Michael, I think Michael Gallup will be better in a West Coast, Coast offense. Yeah. Tony Pollard, assuming he's still around here, in, in a horizontal passing game yeah. where running backs become wide receivers, Tony Pollard is maybe more dangerous than ever. So I absolutely think it'll work, and Mike McCarthy's track record in Green Bay and beyond mm -hmm. says it'll work. That was a little fantasy football tip there, maybe. If yeah. you see Tony Pollard in there in the West Coast offense, better draft. You know, uh, <laughs> pe people talk about him not only as one of the top three running backs yeah. in this free agency class, as one of the top three players. Right. Uh, and th th listen, th we, we can argue about it, but the numbers are inarguable. Mm -hmm. What And the eye test is pretty good, too. The, the splash plays, yeah. um, he, he did that as well as anybody. And then I do think he proved, can he run between the tackles? Can he carry a load? Well... Is he durable? Uh, right. Uh, it's a funny question because people that are asking that must not have looked at the stat sheet. He had more snaps than Zeke. Mm -hmm. So if Zeke is durable enough to have this many snaps mm -hmm. and Tony Pollard is durable enough to have this many snaps, <laughs> then Tony Pollard must be durable enough. Right. Absolutely.